Are we gonna get you to come back and do some videos? Maybe some cooking videos after you're married. Maybe. That would be good, Maybe. right? So after a while. After a while? <laughs> okay. I'll be MIA for the next couple of weeks. Hey, what's up, family? I'm Joe. And I'm Anthony. And this is Two Crazy Ketos. And here on Two Crazy Ketos, we do different things like recipe videos and we do product reviews. We talk about various keto topics. And every Monday, we go live on Keto Beyond the Couch because life exists beyond the couch. Now, you can find us on all kinds of social media like Facebook, Instagram, and X. And we have a website, which is twocrazyketos.com. And that's where you're going to find all of our different recipes. Now we do upload at least five new videos every single week, so make sure you subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to hit that little bell button, this way you are notified every time we upload a new video. I'm here with Anthony. Anthony's getting married in three weeks. Yes, three weeks. Three weeks. Three weeks. Can you believe it's three weeks away? It's crazy. <laughs> I move into another apartment in a few days. Are you excited? I am very excited. Are you gonna make it? Yes, I'll make it. I'll be fine. Life is expensive yes, right is. now. So, guys, I'm so excited. So, we have Anthony with us. Anthony is our middle son. And we're gonna try to get him to continue doing some videos for us, but he's getting married. He's getting married to his long time girlfriend, Sarah. How long have you guys been together? Five years. And you've known each other for like- 13 or 14. Yeah. Since we were 13 or 14. Yeah, you've known each other for like over 10 years. So I'm super excited. We absolutely love Sarah. And I convinced Anthony to do another keto crate box. So I'm actually down before here. Before I go to Texas State Brazil. And before you go to Texas State Brazil. So we're down here right now in Coconut Creek. I rode out Hurricane Milton with Anthony and Caleb, brought the RV down here, and I decided that I was gonna try to convince him to do this keto crate video before I leave and head up to Keto Palooza. So if you don't know what a keto crate is, this is a monthly subscription box. It's got anywhere between like eight to 10 different types of keto snacks. It's a great way to find some new things that are on the market without buying an entire case of them. We found lots of different things in here. Um, and we're gonna ha have Anthony do this with us because mm -hmm. Anthony is a foodie. Anthony is brutally honest. If you haven't seen one of these, I'm sorry, but he's brutally honest. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go over each item. We're gonna discuss how much it costs. We're gonna go over the ingredients and then we're gonna taste them. If Anthony likes it, there's a pretty good chance you're gonna like it. If he doesn't like it, it's 50-50. Are you ready? I'm ready. Okay, here we go. All right. I control the box. You control the box. Um, let me give you this. Monk pack. Okay, so monk pack. I don't have my glasses with me, so I'm gonna let you read them. Okay. Or at least that one, because I can't read it. Ingredients, almonds, allulose, peanuts, pumpkin seeds, sunflower seeds, tapioca fiber, non-GMO corn fiber, palm kernel and palm oil, rice flour, alkalized cocoa powder, sea salt, unsweetened chocolate, lecithin, natural flavor, coconut oils, mixed tofurols with vitamin E for freshness, monk fruit extract, uh, contains almonds, peanuts, coconut, all that stuff. Serving size is one bar. Okay. Um, 13 grams of fat. Um, 14 total carbs, five grams of fiber. So that makes it 11. Dang, that's a lot. No, there's gotta be allulose in it. Uh, oh, allulose, there it is. Six grams. So six plus five. So there's three net carbs in this. We've had monk packs before. Yeah. I like them. I, I actually don't. like this one. I don't like the granola type bar. I don't like these. You don't like them? I don't know. Like... Pick a nut and stay with it. I don't like the 45 different nuts in there. I like them personally. Uh, price on those are, oh, we're getting to see everything that's in the box. $2.29. Yeah. All right. Schoolyard snacks. Cocoa cereal. Okay. Those are like Cocoa Pops. Ingredients. Oh, that's a bad aftertaste. I don't like that. I don't think I, I don't I don't like it every single time I have it. Whey protein isolate, 
at what is it? acid casein. Okay, allulose, high olic sunflower oil, tapioca starch, alkalis, cocoa powder, erythritol, calcium carbonate, natural flavors, sea salt, stevia, and monk fruit extract, rosemary extract, extract to preserve freshness. The serving size is one bag, um, four grams of fat, eight grams of total carb, one gram of fiber, and two grams of sugar alcohol, making it five net carbs. And there's some allulose, I think, too, up here on the top. Oh, and four grams of allulose. So one gram of fiber, two grams of monk fruit extract, and four grams of allulose, making it one net carb. Okay, we've had these before. Um, I like the old formulation better than the new one, but it's also been a long time since I had them, so I don't know if they've improved it at all. It's like got, fruity pebbles. It's got a weird fruity taste. Yeah, no, that's not it. Yeah. Ooh. I've had the other company, like Snack House Foods. I like theirs better. Uh, price on these are two dollars and seventy-five cents a package. A little expensive. Those too. nasty. Okay. What's next? Okay. Some of these are actually. Some of these are looking pretty good. All right. Dang. I'm gonna give you this one. This one. Better than good foods, protein, grab-and-go puffs, jalapeno, cheddar, and... Do you need I, me to read them again? I think I need you to read them again. What are, you, what, are you, what are you contributing to this video? I don't know. All right. Where are the ingredients? I don't know. Oh, they really hid this one, huh? Okay. It's like under this, but it's glued. Okay. Ingredients. Milk protein isolate, natural jalapeno seasoning, which contains whey powder, salt, buttermilk powder, spices, yeast extract, yeast extract, and cheddar cheese powder. Cultured milk, salt, enzymes, natural flavor, silicone dioxide, which is a natural anti-caking agent. Paprika ex extractives, okay. Sunflower oil for sunflower oil, fruit and vegetable blend of spinach, broccoli, carrot, beet, tomato, shiitake, mushroom, apple, cranberry, cherry, orange, blueberry, and strawberry. Okay. So. Again, they really glued this. All right, the serving size is one pack, 110 calories, three and a half grams of fat, three grams of total carb with three sugars. Okay. So no added sugar. I'm assuming the sugar is probably coming from the fruit juices. From the fruit juices. Okay. Have we had this before? We've had this company before. It's like developed by a mom for her kids. That's pretty good. good. That's pretty good. That would be a good road treat for, uh -huh. my, for my 15 hour drive. All right. Price on those. <clears throat> Ooh, they're a little spicy. Yeah, they are. They got three dollars. Dang, I don't know what I want to get. What I'm, I'm gonna do this. Well, I guess I'm doing all of them. How I'm gonna read some of them. I can read that one. Okay, Southern recipe: small batch pork rinds, hot honey mm -hmm. flavor. These are it. I love hot honey. Okay, pork rind, sunflower oil, sugar, salt, tapioca starch, chipotle powder, garlic powder, onion powder, spicy uh, uh, spices, uh, acetic acid, tortilla yeast, honey, paprika extract, natural flavor, natural smoke flavor. I don't know why they're putting sugar in it, but I guess it is a hot honey flavor. Not something that I would normally use. So they say there's four servings in this package. No. It's one. Uh, maybe two. So in one serving, it's 70 calories, four and a half grams of fat, one total carbohydrate, and three grams, six grams of protein. But they have it listed as five total carbs if you have the package. So when you round it down, like it goes under zero, mm. but personally, not something that I would normally do. It's, it's pretty good. good. Anything hot honey is good. I okay. Mean, it's like the best flavor of anything. Price on those are $5.49. I pay that. Next up. I don't know. These are looking good. Chili and lime fava licious. So it's fava beans. I don't know what that is. We've had them before. Never even heard of this. 
All right. No junk. Everything you don't, everything you need, nothing you don't. So, ingredients. Fava beans roasted in expeller press high sunflower oil, whatever. Lime power, lime powder, which is IP maltodextrin and lime juice concentrate, paprika salt, ground red pepper, onion powder, and cumin. Two servings per container. There's a lot in this container. I will I will go with that one on this. Um, there is six grams per serving, uh, 13 grams of total carbs, eight grams of fiber, one gram of sugar. So five net carbs if you had, if you have. Yeah, but it's all beans. Yeah, it's all beans. So what, you've had this before? Yeah, not this flavor, but I've had fava beans before. I actually like them. They got a, they, they're kind of remind me almost like of, oh, these are crunchy. I've had the soft ones. Oh, I like those. I don't really taste much. Don't they are go. crunchy. They, they're not bad. I, I would prefer maybe a little bit more salt. I like the crunch. I've had the soft ones where you oh, put yeah, them in the refrigerator bad, and they're kind of like edamame. But these are, I like them roasted. Those are good. I had a better one. That that was a lot better than one. Okay, price on those, $2.50. All right. On to the next one. Raspberry Shameless Snacks ra Red Raspberry Sour Scouts. Not looking forward to this one. There's not that many ingredients. It says three grams of sugar right on the front. Oh, it does? Three grams of net, oh. Oh, net carbs. No, okay. it says three grams of, net sh of sugar, it does. Ingredients, polydextrose, soluble corn fiber, erythritol, pectin, glycerin, malic acid, citric acid, sodium citrate, natural raspberry flavor, purple carrot juice for color, isomalt, and sucralose. Lots of fibers. All right. Serving size is one bag. No fat. 30, 37 total carbs. 26 grams of fiber. 3 grams of total sugar. 8 grams of sugar alcohol. So 37 minus 26 minus 8 is 3 net carbs. Why is there sugar in there if you're using sugar alcohols? I don't, well, I think because of the raspberry flavor. The raspberry got sugar in it now. Raspberries are pretty low in carbs. Oh, this literally looks like a Sour Patch Kid. Of course, it's a trademark. Hold on, though. They're good. This tastes like a way cleaner Sour Patch Kid. Like, like it hasn't been processed in a million different things. They're good. They're not sour, though. They're not sour. Oh. I don't know. It's too many carbs for me. You can have them. Price They're on good. those are four dollars a package. No. 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 Good Sam. Peanut butter cups. Be an ally for small farms. Peanut butter. I love peanut butter cups. Okay. Where are the ingredients? Peanut butter. That's good. Allulose. Cocoa mass, cocoa butter, inulin, sustainable organic palm oil, salt, and sunflower lecithin. That is a clean peanut butter cup. So there are three peanut butter cups in a serving, and there's five servings in the bag. So three peanut butter cups is 140 calories, 11 grams of fat, 4 grams of protein. What is that? 11 total carbohydrates, 4 grams of dietary fiber. That is pretty good. I'm looking for how much allulose. Is there any place on here that tells you how much allulose? I don't see any place where it tells me how much allulose there is. Oh, here it is. Um, so four carbs, three grams of fiber, one net carb. So that's going to be five grams of allulose. Okay, you ready? Mm-hmm. Oh, that's even better. They're individually wrapped. There you go. That made me work for it. Yeah, but that means you may not even eat all three of them. Well, thank God they don't do what Reese's does where they put the additional wrapper on it. Like, why are you wasting my time? Nope. It's not good. I think they dropped all the salt. I just say salt. I like it. Definitely more chocolate than peanut butter. There's so much salt. That's because you're not on keto. 
Your mom will like those. Okay. There's more salt in those than in the. No. Wait a minute. Let me look at the price here. The price on those are eight dollars for the bag. No, give me that. How much? How much sodium is in this? Ain't no way. Thirty-five milligrams. At, no, there, there's two hundred milligrams in this. Nah, I believe. I just. I didn't disbelief. Okay. There's no well, way. I like them. All right. I uh, this, this, this is fascinating to me. Butter cookies. Okay. Chalk zero. I remember getting these on a little tin. Oh yeah. These are interesting. Look, they come in a nice little box. I feel like they're just trying to do this for like Christmas. They're trying to go into that little area. All right. Oh, God, that tastes bad. <laughs> <clears throat> All right. Ingredients. Almond butter, non-GMO resistant dextrin, butter, sustainable palm fruit oil, eggs, whole milk powder, rice flour, oat fiber, baking soda, vanilla flavor, salt, monk fruit extract. Contains almond, egg, and oats. Eight servings per can per container. There's about four cookies per serving. Okay. 140 calories, 11 grams of fat, 12 grams of total carbs, 8 grams of fiber, making it four. Or is, is there allulose anywhere on it? I, I didn't see. hear you say allulose. Okay. Nice little box. Okay. Oh, nice little container. Oh, it, oh look at that. Oh, that's kind of cool. Those are pretty cool. Yeah. Look at the pretzel one. Are they all going to be the same? No, they all will, 100%, but... Okay. It's good. Those are dangerous. Those are really good. These are mine. Those are... Oh, my God. They're Those are good. good. I'd eat the whole package. They're pretty good. Just tastes like a regular sugar cookie. Okay, price on those, $8 for mm. the box. Dang, that's good. Okay. All right, last one. <clears throat> I always have them with a meat stick. All right. Wow, I, I can barely read these. Beef, water, salt, encapsulated citric acid, cultured celery powders, which is celery powder and salt, turmeric extract, black pepper, red pepper, garlic powder, coriander, onion powder, stuffed in a beef collagen casing. I don't see any. Yeah, a lot of times they don't have nutrition labels on that. Okay, well, it's, it's beef. So it is smoky turmeric is the flavor. Assume it's one carb per stick. That's good. Not much of a flavor to it. It just tastes like a beef stick. Yeah. Price on that tastes one. Tastes like a regular old beef stick. Not, not, nothing fancy. I like that one that was like pepperoni pizza flavor. That one was so, so good. Price on that one is $2. So that's everything that's going to be in this box. Why don't we give one of these boxes away? What do you think? This box was a meh, huh? Meh. No? What? You, you liked everything? The butter cookies? This? This the these the, the raspberry snacks? The pork rinds? The the beans were pretty good. The jalapeno puff? The only thing that were amiss were the I didn't really like the schoolyard snack. Me there was either. a lot of stuff in this box. Okay. Well, it's a hit for Anthony. It's a meh for me. Well, Last month's box I really like. Okay, I'm wrong. I'm always wrong with Anthony. So we're gonna give one of these away. Here's what you need to do. Number one, you do need to live in the United States. Sorry, there's just laws in other countries. Sorry, Canada. Um, you do need to be subscribed to the channel. We are going to check. Leave a comment down below. Any comment you wanna leave is fine. And then we'll leave down in the description box the day we're gonna pick the winner. You also have to have the notification bell turned on because the way we're gonna let you know that you won is by responding to your comment. And if you don't have the notification bell on, you won't know that we responded to your comment and then you won't be able to send us your shipping information. And then we got to give away the box to somebody else. So we really appreciate you guys for joining us. Thank you so much, Anthony, for doing one more of these. Are we going to get you to come back and do some videos, maybe some cooking videos after you're married? Maybe. That would be good, maybe. right? So After a while. After a while? <laughs> okay. I'll be MIA for the next couple of weeks. Okay. So 
hopefully let us know down in the comment section should Anthony come back and visit the channel every once in a while and do some cooking videos, maybe another birria video, that would be awesome. Some smoking videos. How much were these cookies again? Huh? Eight dollars for the box. Put them. Let us know down in the comment section. Now, if you like seeing videos like this, take a look at some of the videos we have linked right over there. Also, make sure you take a look at the most recent video that I'm gonna put right over here. But whether you head that way or you head this way, make sure you go this way. Subscribe to our channel and hit that little bell button. This way you are notified every time we upload a new video. Until next time, bye. bye.